Hey everyone, it's Jenny. Welcome back to my channel. As you can tell, I am in a better mood right now than I was last week. It was pretty pretty rough for me, but we're gonna start over because today, as you're watching this, it's now Lunar New Year's! Happy New Year's to all my Vietnamese, Chinese, and whoever celebrates Lunar New Year's. Well, in Vietnamese, we say Chúc mừng năm mới. So, Happy New Year's to, to those that understood me. So, I'm gonna just pretend that Lunar New Year's is the new year for 2020, okay? Definitely want to be in a more positive mood and more happy. So, we're just gonna let that go. What a better way to start off the new year than to DIY some stuff. So, I wanted to make some stuff for the wedding flower girl basket and the ring barrier pillow thing. And I got some signs I want to make too. So, let's get started. I bought this basket from the thrift store and it was only two dollars. Yeah, two dollars I think is a really good deal for a basket because I was looking at flower girl baskets online It was like ten dollars like fifteen dollars or something like that and they're not that cute I mean, they're cute, but nah, it didn't, it didn't go with my theme So I wanted to make something that would go better with my theme for the wedding I got this and then I got this pillow sheet from Walmart I forgot how much it was. It was like six bucks or something like that, but it goes so well with my color theme for the wedding. It's like a pillow sham. I thought there was two in there, but there's only one. We'll see if this works. I think it's big enough to wrap the basket as well as making a pillow with one one sheet. We'll figure it out. Yeah, so you know how the pillow cover has like the slit right here? I think I'm gonna use, let's see. I have a lot of stuff on the table right now. I think that be enough. Maybe we should use that for the pillow because the pillow doesn't have to be that big. Okay. So my sister has my fabric scissors. She hasn't given it back yet. She says she bought her own fabric scissors. That scissor was very expensive, so give it back, bro. Oh, shoot. Messed up already. I cut on the other side. I was trying to like make a video for New Year's you know, to come out today, but I figured that I wanted to vlog and I'll, I'll probably post that sometime this week, maybe, we'll see. I will put some inspirations on the screen of what I want the pillow to look like. Oh my God, I'm just cutting on the other side of the pillow now. I just don't wanna waste the fabric that I have because this is all I got, guys. Put that aside, this piece, and work with that for a pillow. How big does a pillow have to be? Oh my god. I cut the sheet down a little bit more so it, it folds into like the square. We're gonna fold the nice side in like that. Yeah. And then we're gonna sew all around here on the edges. Normally I would just use like hot glue gun, but it's for the wedding. You gotta make it nice, right? Yeah, I'm gonna sew. Yeah, your girl knows how to sew too. Talented girl right here. Just kidding. I'm gonna get a good, good amount of thread. Trying to figure that out. There we go. There we go. I'm gonna get the other end. Did I make a knot? Oh my god. I made a knot on accident. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we, we did it. We did it. My sewing stuff. I don't have any pins. <laughs> We're gonna sew. You guys can't see what I'm doing. This would be so much faster if I brought out my sewing machine, but I'm just too lazy right now, guys. The house is a mess. I should have cleaned it, but I didn't. Okay, I didn't. Please. Moving on still. We're still gonna move on, guys. You want, you can use a glue gun. Glue all around the edges, the same thing, but for the wedding, I just don't want it to explode. This way, I know for sure. Pretty, 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 pretty stable. I wanted to put burlap onto here. Make it work. We're gonna make this work somehow, guys. I wanna put this on here, like that. You see? You see? Can you envision it with me? We're gonna take this out. I'm gonna take this out. This is why my DIYs take me so freaking long to film. Cause this is how I work. My mind just jumbles. It just jumbles so much. I'm gonna fold that in. I'm just gonna 
myself. I'm gonna burn myself. I just know it. I just know it. It's not that bad. It's not that bad yet. Oh my god. I knew it. I knew I was supposed to do one side for a reason. Ouch. finish sewing and then and then we'll we'll get back to that part as long as we fold like the inside in I think we're okay we're okay let's continue with the sewing okay let's see if you guys can see how I do this oh you guys cannot let's just Jenny 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 finish sewing all along like the two ends or the two sides we're gonna leave an opening right here because you need to be able to flip it out inside out and then put the stuffing in okay so we'll be back when I get to that part all right we're almost at the end yes guys I did hurt myself already I poked myself with this needle okay cut that off Glue this part down. What the? Come on. There we go. There we go. One side glued on. Glued on. Now, gotta stuff it. You stuff it from my last DIY. Put a good amount of, you don't want it too fluffy, you want it kind of like flat, a little bit. Distribute it evenly throughout. It's a decent sized pillow. Well, something inside first. Looking pretty cute, I hope so. What do you guys think so far? I hope I don't regret all these DIYs for my wedding. I hope I don't look back and be like, girl, what were you thinking? Why didn't you just pay for it? Why didn't you just buy something? Just be done with it instead of making yourself, you know, a pillow and a basket and a centerpiece. I just hope I don't regret it. I hope Jimmy's okay with it too. Hot glue, sorry. Hot glue it. Let's close it up. Slowly coming together. I think we got a pillow. Okay, they're tippy tapping, they're too loud. Come here. Okay, come here. This is Rocky. He's scared of firecrackers. <laughs> You're okay, bud. You're okay. You can hang out with mom. Okay. What do you guys think so far for the pillow? I think it's pretty cute. What else do you need? They're just walking on like the rings on top, right? What else do you need on here? Just gonna look nice. Rockstar. <gasps> look at him. Yeah, people could see you. Yeah. So now I wanna put mine around it, but at first I wanted to put some flowers on here. Flowers, so. I think this one's a nice one. Should I tie this twine on first? I'm confused. think so far cute right I think I'm gonna leave the pillow like this because it actually looks pretty cute without the flowers I was trying to be extra and add some flowers on it like this or something like that but it just I don't know it doesn't look nice right to me so I think this just looks really cute the way it is gonna move on to the basket now all right so let's just you know clean up the table a little bit done with the pillow so now we can move on to our basket Get. Grab our material, rest of our pillowcase. God, I just, what is this? Look at this. And then over here, like, do you see this? Do you see 
see that? Maybe we should cut this part off. So it's like one layer. I mean, it's tucked inside anyways. I don't think people would see the holes. Let's see, now we have one layer. That doesn't look better. Okay. Cushion. Get a little, like, fluffy. Have some cushion. I think this video is like the least thought out DIY video that I've done yet. All right, guys. So I did is glue on burlap right in front of the basket. Okay. Now how do I do this? Right where the burlap starts, right there. Or ends, starts or ends. <sighs> Gonna glue the lace all the way around to the side. You see, it's glued on. They're like a match to each other. Almost done. Twine. Cut. I went to the Dollar Tree and I was like picking up all the stuff. And then like my bridesmaids were all like, do you even need it? I was just like, one day I will. And see, see you guys, today's the day. I'm trying to center the twine guys. Of the twine. I didn't think through this video at all, okay? I, I seriously did not. Like, sometimes I have a game plan of what I'm doing, you know? Most of the time, I have a guide, something that was like pre made, not pre made, like a photo or something that I can look through, but this one, nothing. So I really just did this on my own, and I'm hoping I don't regret it because this is wedding day stuff. So I, I really don't even look like ratchet or anything. I really wished that you guys can hear like what's going on in my mind right now, because there's a lot. There's like, you should do this, you should do that. Last one at the bottom, right here. And then we can snip. What do you guys think adding that? Was that was that a no-no? I think it's pretty cute. I don't know. What do you guys think? Alright guys, I think I'm just gonna leave the basket as is. It looks pretty cute and it really matches the pillow. Like, look at this. I think they're adorable. What you, pretty? Okay, so on to the next. I got the sign from the Dollar Tree. Your girl actually bought new paint. We're gonna paint this sign. The O with the heart to be in pink for sure though. was done with the sign and then I was just like all you did was just paint it you know like it's so basic and I'm not basic I'm extra so I found these pearls and I plan to put it around like like the O the heart because why not Jenny you are not a basic be extra be your extra self why are you shaking? The heck? Why are you shaking so much? I think this is gonna look real cute Look at it. Look at it. Tell me that doesn't look so much better. Oh my god. Like, thing. Like, it. Oh my god. And then I know that the heart is cute and all, but huh? Huh? Okay, maybe it doesn't look that nice on camera, but. No, that's the extra girl that I know I am. So we're gonna leave that on the side. <laughs> Alright guys. 
guys, so that's all my DIYs for this video. I hope that you guys liked all the DIYs. Made a sign that says love. We made a flower girl basket, boom, and then a ring barrier pillow. I literally did not spend that much. Again, the pillow case thing was only like six dollars and then the basket was two dollars the stuffing I already had everything else was from the Dollar Tree the burlap is from the Dollar Tree so is the twine and the lace so probably spent under I want to say fifteen dollars no less than that way less than that ten dollars for all this stuff like dude these two alone was gonna cost me like twenty something dollars like it's a lot of money so I saved and they look pretty cute and it's personalized to you and your wedding why not make your own when you can? Save yourself some money. You know, like I know how expensive a wedding is because I'm planning mine. If you can make it yourself, my suggestion, I think you should. I mean, you're personalizing it for your wedding again and you'll be so proud that you made this on your own and you know when people ask you like oh where'd you guys get that you guys can be like oh i made it myself duh i hope you guys enjoy this video if you're new what are you doing make sure you hit that subscribe button down below make sure you thumbs up the video and share this out share it out with everyone that you know we're about to hit our 500 subscribers our next milestone i'm so excited let's get it guys 2020 new year new me same me <laughs> Alright guys, I'll see you guys next time.